I'm gonna go tell the manager if you guys don't be quiet. Many mighty mo, catch him by the throat. And if a nigga talking, we gon' never let him go. I'm out here feeling so slow, yeah, I'm poor folk. I got that mud with the seal, bitch, you know I'm dead. Have you seen a nigga that's so cozy? What's good, y'all? It's Jay Cook, so you know I do what I do, and we do what we do, and we hit 20K, baby! <laughs> yeah, yeah, way. I just want to say I love you guys so much. Like, you guys don't even understand. We're growing, growing, growing. I think it's only been like two and a half weeks, three weeks maybe, um, since we first started the channel, uh, you know, Jay Cook. And so since that, we we got 20K subscribers, 20K cookies as I can say. So I just want to say I love you guys so much. And for that, you know, you guys have been asking me to prank, 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 prank Julius and Kenny, like blowing up my Snapchat asking me. So um, I had to do it for you guys. And I feel like this is something that's different <clears throat> than all like the other YouTubers be doing, but it's still going to be funny. Like it's because I already know. So the funny thing is, is Julius always be worried about, <clears throat> you know, they have these things. Hold up, I'm about to go up to the door. They be having, they be having, uh, you know, like notices and stuff like on their doors 24 seven when people live here at these apartments, right? So, um, you know, he always be joking like, oh, what if one day we come home and, uh, you know, there's an eviction notice or something and they're just messed up or some stuff. So since he's always joking, you know, karma gets you. And so I feel like this is going to be surreal to him. He's going to feel like it's it's real because he's always joking about it. <laughs> um, so for that being said, I did an eviction notice prank. Here, I'm going to show you guys the paper right here. I did an eviction notice prank. Shit. I can't I can't hold it but basically what it is is an eviction fake eviction notice or whatever has his name and all that I did all like the little fake thing and I signed the thing so what I'm gonna say is you feel me I'm just gonna kind of explain the fact that I seen it on his door so I took it to the office I was trying to be you feel me a good friend or something and then uh, I signed the papers for him basically saying um, you know, he's all good, but it's not all good. I signed the papers and it's basically saying, you know, he's agreeing to be evicted. That he's not going to pay his rent anymore and all that. And so this is going to be funny. So let's see how it goes. I hope you don't get too mad, uh, but I hope you guys enjoy the video. Shout out to you guys again for 20K. We got some special coming for y'all. You already know, might have some merch, might have a code collab, might have something coming. I don't know, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But anyways, I love you guys so much. And it's Jay Cook Gang, Cookie Gang. Now let's get these prank wars started. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys, I have a second camera that I had already set up <clears throat> hidden like behind the TV area um, so that when I walk in there or whatever, it's all good and we'll be straight. Here, they're, I think they're cooking right now, so. We should be good. Oh, my finger stuck. Oh! Yep, we got the rice right here on it, man. I'm strapped, bro. Strapped. Oh, it's man. all bad. What have you? I don't know. I heard Sam. Like yesterday, I had seen like this little paper on your door. What is it? They, be, they be always, they always be putting them papers because they, like that, they just put one today about some Christmas party tomorrow. I'm not going to that. I might go to the Christmas party though. I'm not even going to lie. This is, <laughs> what Christmas party? They put one party on tomorrow. My they put it on my door. Free food, drinks. I'm going to drink. I'm sorry, this is not a Christmas party though. That's what is that? So, that's what I was going to explain to you. So yesterday, when I came, when you guys were at the mall or whatever, I went to the door, and you know how they always be having the papers on the door? Mm -hmm. And I seen like a little like thing, and it, it was like highlighted yellow, and I was like, nothing's ever highlighted. So then, I took it off, and it said eviction notice. But what? I didn't, but I thought it was like a joke. Like, I ain't, you feel me? I didn't think it was real. So I took it to the, uh, to the office, and they're like, oh, um, they're like, we try to knock on the door or whatever, because <clears throat> you guys are one out of the three people that have got eviction notices. And uh, they were like, you don't know, 
They tried you calling you, they tried emailing you and everything. You didn't answer none. Bro, you didn't call them? That's a lie. I'll go up there right there and call you. Didn't, like you haven't been checking your emails? No, I did check them on emails. They didn't call me or nothing. I don't answer. You're yeah, lying, bro. But they were just like for like uh, release information, like to give me more information. I just had to sign something. I thought I was just signing something. And that's why I, that's why I fucked up. You had to sign something. I'm not even gonna lie, bro. I so probably what? I kind of fucked up. So what do you mean you fucked up? It's a financial agreement. So basically, I guess what it's saying is like all of the. I don't even know how to explain it. Basically, everything that they're doing financially with what they want out of you, I accidentally signed because they thought I was the one that owned. How do you accidentally so sign something? They think they're gonna get money off of me. They're not getting no money out of me. You signed it. It's coming out of you. But I didn't... But it wasn't like... So I don't what? think it... I don't feel like... I don't feel like the... Like you're going to get evicted right now. But I feel like it's it's bad because now they have something in writing. And they think like it's your signature. Because I have a J. You have a J too. But your name is J Cook. My name is J Brown. I know. But I just put like... Look, the scribble is like real like... You gave it to him? I, this is the copy. This is the... There was a second paper under it, and this is the... Why did you sign it, though? Look, look at it. Why, how can you sign it? Because I thought it was... I thought they were saying that everything was good if I sign it. Like, it was just like a notice, like a, a warning, basically. You know, like when you get put over by the cops, and then they give well, you a warning? I'm about to call Tatiana, bro, because she works here. She's the manager. It's over. They're not evicting me. It's over. They it's not, bro. I think they are. They evict me. Bro, it really says the financial. They might up your rent too, bro. They're gonna up the rent. It's a, I'm not paying anything. I'm, they're not evicting me. I'm bro, not, they're gonna up it. Though. They're gonna come to the door and they're not. They're gonna make me. They're gonna have to make me leave. I'm not leaving. I didn't do nothing. We didn't do nothing, bro. It's a, they're gonna up the rent for next month. Yeah, they said something about they're upping it like three. We didn't four. even. We didn't even do nothing. I didn't even do nothing. Nobody even is loud no more. We used to be loud a long time ago. But I think because we were loud so many times. The part of the neighbor, it'd be, you know, it'd be the agent. I think it was the lady, bro, when we were in the hot tub, bro. It's hot. That lady wasn't actually told. And then she now we have this. Her. When we were if in the hot told, tub. If she told, I swear to God. I'm going to go knock on her door. I'm gonna. Leave. They're going to evict me and they're going to move me out. And every day I'm coming back here making hella noise. Like a band, I'm bringing. I really band. do. It was that lady, bro. There's no way because remember she came down. It was in the hot tub. She's like, I'm gonna go tell the manager if you guys don't be quiet. It's and all then, good though because we could just. How is it all good if we get evicted? That makes no sense. We're not gonna be good on the street. On that, bro. You can go, nigga. You can go back to Tacoma. I'm going back to Arizona. He bro, what do I look like no, going back to going Washington? Back to no Washington. You're tripping. It's cold. I like it here. I don't like Washington. And I don't like that lady. I'm gonna. I like. Clean. I like. I like this. I like it here. Swear to God, bro, you're playing, right? I'm not playing, bro. It's hey, where's my phone? I'm finna call Tatiana right bro, now. Bro, you gotta call her ASAP. No, I got, I you got, gotta call her right now, bro. This phone only. Where's my other phone? I don't know. Find it. I don't know. I really don't know. And I don't have her number, so you gotta call her ASAP. Because the office is about to close in literally hey, five they, minutes. When did they put that on there, Justice? Yesterday, I went. I and came up. Why did you wait till today to tell right us? Right here it says 2.46 p.m. Why did you wait till today to tell us? That's, because that's, I was scared. That's when they put it on there or that's when they printed the paper? I thought it was a joke. I'm not even going to lie. I thought you guys were pranking me. You feel me? Like, oh, you feel me? Trying to, like, act like, oh, it's her. Oh, Justice, if I call her, bro, please don't. 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 This is not a prank. Is this a prank? Bro, it's not a prank. You called her? <laughs> I didn't call her, bro. You know, I went up to the office, I'm telling you right I now. I think my other phone, I don't have her number, her phone, her, her number in this phone. Bro. We might as well start. Why didn't you tell us, no, though? No, bro, it's all right. You, you, well, you, you might as well start. But look, though, right this now. is what I want to know. Why, didn't, why did you wait till today to tell us? Today to tell us. So I can't even talk right because I'm mad. Because, bro, I didn't, I didn't want it to be, you feel me, to ruin nothing between, you feel me, who cares? You right. You have to tell us. We're gonna get in trouble, for sure. Yeah. Um, so Your grandpa's gonna be hella mad. Okay. Mm. Bro, so find we, your phone and call her. So you're doing all this extra, right. and you're not even looking for your phone. Stomach cards. Yeah. Okay. Who cares? Find your this phone. This is a whole consent form right here, basically saying. Honestly, you probably have to move. What is this? Is it says seven, eight, or hey, my 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 stomach hurts now. 
I don't want to talk about it anymore, bro. Because if I get evicted, I'm in so much trouble. And I can't go back to Washington. I'm not good over there. It's too cold and people don't like me. Is this mine? I don't know. Why are you laughing? What is funny? I don't understand why you find something funny. It's like, a prank! Jake Cook! Cookie Gang! You already know what's going on. Y'all see the cameras right here hitting behind the TV. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you were a good one for that. I, I thought we were really gonna get evicted because we weren't that loud. And that lady really did go tell on us. All right. You already know it's a prank wars, baby. You know what I'm saying? It's not funny. Stuff. That's for hitting 20k, man. That's for hitting 20k. I can't even get it off the tape. How you feeling, man? Man, I'm mad. I ain't even gonna lie. He's done. His ass is grass. I'm getting him right back. Hey, shout out Cookie Gang, man. You already know what it is. That look kind of hurt back there. It's all good because we still got the eviction notice. Who knows? <clears throat> they might actually get evicted now because I made so much noise. But it's all good. Uh, you know, it's Jay Cook, Cookie Gang, till we die. I'm going to keep coming with the pranks. This is just step one. This is phase number one. They look, they look kind of look a little sad just sitting there. His stomach hurts. He got a little too sad now. His stomach hurts. But uh, you know it's cookie game until we die, man. I want to say shout out to you guys for 20K. You know I had to do something special. I haven't done a prank. I mean, I did a prank on my mom, but I wanted to do something more like serious. I guess that is serious too, the pregnancy prank. But like, you know what I'm saying. But um, yeah, you know, you don't even know what it is, baby. You know what I'm saying. I love you guys so much. I got to give you kisses. Mwah. You feel what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Uh, what else was I going to say? I don't know. I've been saying. I know you know what I'm saying a lot. Oh, so make sure you share with your auntie, your granny, your cousin, your daddy, your mommy, your cousins, your kids, your uncle. I don't know. But make sure you share with them because I love you guys. I know the cookie gang loves you guys. You see them back there. They're talking. They're probably about to try to prank me. It's all bad, but it's all good at the same time. You know what I'm saying? It's Jay Cook, so you know I do what I do, and I'm going to keep coming with these pranks. I'm going to keep coming with these videos every single day. I got a video for you guys tomorrow. So go ahead, share with everybody. I love you guys so much. It's Cookie Gang. Oh, yeah. Oh, whoa. Well, uh, that way. Yeah, I love you guys. Let's get it.